evening all chief prepper here hopefully this will be short um i think we all need to continue prepping i know that i am sick to death and exhausted of hearing pretty much bad news there's a couple channels that i used to kind of like but now I'm, I'm tired of looking at their clickbait so here's the thing that maybe people aren't thinking about you need to continue prepping for all the things you prep for, but you need to consider one thing that might change drastically. A paradigm shift the way we currently live to the way we may be living after something happens. Imagine a world where you can't go to the store to get what you're going to get. Not for like a couple of weeks or a couple of months, but for like the foreseeable future. You need to consider that and seriously uh, maybe think about it. Uh, so stock up on what you can. Nothing's changed. Food, water, security, clothing, winter and summer, shelter, uh, way to filter water, way to cook your food, way to stay warm in the winter. Uh, in the summer, if we don't have electricity, we're just going to live without air conditioning. We're going to discover why the old people got up early and worked till around 10 or 11, took a long break, and then came back out in the late evening and finished. So because uh i know in texas even if we're climatized experiencing the heat we experience in san antonio is it's atrocious <laughs> so anyway uh that's it think about the possibility of a complete paradigm shift you know it can be caused by emps it can be caused by nuclear war it can be caused by uh, economic collapse it doesn't matter why or how it happens, but that's something you should consider. So, uh, it just seems like the world wants us to fight each other. Been to war twice. It sucked both times. Real bad. Anyway, something to consider. Chief Prepper.